The Swim Skin 25 is a floating surface skimmer which is suitable for ponds with a minimum depth of 40 centimetres and with surface areas of up to 25 square metres. Because the skimmer floats, it adapts to any water level fluctuations. Three large floats keep the skimmer on the surface, while a powerful suction pump takes in 2,500 litres of water per hour, removing debris such as leaves and pollen from the water surface before they can sink and spoil the water environment. The debris is automatically transferred to a removable debris collection basket, which can be easily emptied when full. A fine sponge located under the collection basket traps slightly smaller particles removed from the surface whilst providing additional biological filtration. Always consult a qualified electrician when installing any electrical equipment in your garden and remember to disconnect the power supply before entering the water or performing any maintenance task on your pond and pond equipment. To install the swim skin, first remove all packaging. Read the instruction manual carefully to familiarise yourself with the product. Then connect the floats to the main skimmer body and adjust the air outlet on the bottom of the skimmer. If required, anchor the unit by attaching rope to the connection on the base of the skimmer, then fix it to the shore with pegs. Place the skimmer on the water and submerge several times and hold it underwater for a few seconds to remove any air trapped inside. Now the swim skin can be connected to the power supply. For regular maintenance, disconnect the power supply, lift out the debris collection basket and foam and rinse out. For more thorough cleansing, once you've rinsed out the debris collection basket, remove the air distributor from the base. Then remove the skimmer base from the top section by pressing in the three sides where indicated. Taking care not to detach the air hose from the injector, remove the pump and unscrew the retaining nut for the injector. Twist off the front pump housing and remove, then remove the impeller unit by pulling. Clean all components and the impeller chamber using clean water and a brush and replace all the components in reverse order. Then replace in the pond and reconnect to the power supply.